Oh, is that a bad guy? Right, Nine. so we're in reception. <laughs> Nine! <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. Uh, what's the name of the tower? Nakatomi. That's the one. Nakatomi Towers. Is it place? Nakatomi Place. No, I think it's Nakatomi Towers. No, I think it's Nakatomi Tower. Yeah, okay. Loading. Well, I'm probably going to be terribly wrong, and someone's going to correct me, but yeah. it, I, I'm pretty sure it's Nakatomi Tower. So, in memory, of sweet, sweet memory of our dear friend, who we were... Not close to at all, but no. we adored yeah. Alan Rickman. Uh, we decided to play the only Die Hard game we had that Alan Rickman... Uh, the only game we had that Alan Rickman's actually in. We don't have any of the Harry Potter games. But we do have Die Hard Trilogy on the PlayStation 1. A terrible game. Mr. Mr. Gruber. Mr. Hans, Hans Gruber. Gruber. Now, the standard uh, 80s bad, like 80s and 90s bad guys are always English, but always German. Yeah, play, play exactly. Guys. English actors playing German. That was... Fuck you, man. So this game's actually quite tough because the controls, and I always end up killing. Get him! Those twins. <laughs> Help me! Do they look suitably German enough for you? Like long hair, like oh fucking hell, they're coming out the walls, man. Not <laughs> <laughs> the walls, man. Not the walls. Like long hair. The, it was always the long-haired German that was always the dangerous one. Yeah. Um, and it was a German again in Die Hard 2, wasn't it? I can't remember. It was like he was, uh. They took over the airport, didn't they? Yeah, yeah. I can't remember. What two's, two's, my, two's my least favourite. What of the. Or of the yeah, of th I think the third one's my favourite. The third one? Yeah, the third one's No, I can't remember though. The one with Samuel L. Jackson. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The one with uh, Jeremy Irons is the brother of. Spoilers, everyone who's not seen. Um, <laughs> Do you know I haven't seen him since? Ooh! I'll take that. I got a machine gun! <laughs> Right, what's the buttons? How so much what's life that do? you got? Are you like invincible or something? No, I think it's the thing at the top, the the like ID badge. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can strafe. Um, what else can I do? I can chuck a grenade. Oops. Yeah, <laughs> such <laughs> so a fire a throwing of the grenade. Oh, look at this gun. So how many terrorists have I got left to kill? Uh, six. I think it's on the top right. It tells me how many I've got left to kill. Oh, is it? Oh, right. Okay. Uh, five left. All right, that's, that's some good guys. That's a bad guy. <laughs> what? All right, can I have? Actually, if they like taken photos and pasted them over people's heads, or I think yeah, I think they're like texturized people's faces. It's it's pretty bad anatomy, isn't it? <laughs> like yeah, they so... don't look human. Oh, well, this is early PS One, though, isn't it? Oh, it must, it must be. When did the first Die Hard? Well, this is the third Die Hard film would have been out by the time this came out. Right. So, I don't know. Oh, there's a guy up here. You shouldn't have freed those guys, they're gonna get in your way, man. This draw distance is incredible, though, isn't it? <laughs> oh, grenade. Great! Great! Great grenade! So, I, I actually. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. I, oh, I actually quite like the voice actor. There in he this. is, he's in left. He's in there, there he is. Yeah, hostage escaped. Oh, he's got some body armour. Oh, look, it goes green above your. Uh... Uh, yeah, it's like overshield. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, all right. So, um, for anyone who doesn't know, um, Hans Gruber, whilst he is a famous bad guy played by Alan Rickman, right. it is also right. a sexual manoeuvre uh, known as a Hans Gruber. So, a Hans Gruber is when you are having sexual relations with a woman. <laughs> and uh, I try I to put not that. have sexual relations with that woman. <laughs> when you are having... Yeah, you, didn't there? Oh, okay. No, there's, um, there's some hostages. Uh... You're having sexual relations with a woman. When you are about to finish, let's say, you... Ooh, secret. Ooh. Um, when you're about to finish, you pull out and you finish over the woman's feet. Why is that called a Hans Gruber? Because though? Bruce Willis is barefoot for throughout I, the whole film. I, I, think know, that's, I don't know why it's not called a Bruce Willis yeah, it should or be. Uh, John McClane, but it's called a Hans Gruber. Yeah, it should be called a John McClane. I think Hans Gruber sounds better as a, as a, as a, as a sex manoeuvre. And it sounds forgettable. Oh shit! Bomb triggered. Oh fuck! What's that? No. Yeah. Cool. Hans Gruber sounds better, and women don't won't know what that is because no one wants 
A Bruce Willis. <laughs> <laughs> well, nobody wants a Hans Gruber once they know what it is. But if you say like, "Hey, Dave, do you want a Hans Gruber?" They're like, "Ooh, yeah, all right." And then it happens. And they're like, "What the fuck is, is that?" It because it's, it's German, and German things always sound dirty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I suppose they're always gross, though. No disrespect, man. <laughs> oh, is that Bago? Right, so Nine. we're in reception. Nine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Right, I'm actually doing better than this than I normally do. Normally I die on the first level. Well, I say normally, I've played this once in the past ten years. <laughs> Look at him dancing! <laughs> right, sorry. Little hostages, hostages, you massacred No, they got, they got in the way. Oh my, look at their bodies, though. <laughs> look at Slango! It's Slango! <laughs> it must have been the developers. It must have been the developers. Nine! <laughs> <laughs> all right. I think you literally have to go all the way to the top of this to win. Uh, which I don't think anyone. Oh, it's, it's kind of like a dungeon crawler, isn't it? Yeah. I'm close to dying. Oh, there you go. Oh, rubbish. Oh man. Right, Joe's turn. I think. What's the buttons? Uh, a is shoot. D pad is move around. And uh, those are roll left and right. And those are. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that! Oh no, we failed, man. Doesn't that happen at the end anyway? Well, they block the tower. Do they block the tower? No. Do they? No, they they block the ground because they're surrounding the tower, aren't they? And they. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Post- oh, uh, oh, no percent. McLean did well. Thank you. Oh, I get to spell out my name. That's right. Let's, let's smell this out. Let's smell, smell this out. <laughs> um, what are we gonna call it? I quite like this. It's quite cool. <laughs> you just casually execute people in a circle. <laughs> what am Ta- I going to spell, Joe? What am I going to spell? Tan. He's not. Gen- he's not going to let me do it. Oh no! All right. No, that's it. Tangent with two T's. Um, Should have put R tangent. Oh no! I accidentally killed a guy. Um. Yippee ki yay! Yippee ki yay! Doesn't say motherfucker though. What rating is this game? Oh, it hasn't got an age rating! Whoa. It hasn't got an age rating. Oh no, it's 18 plus. Really? Yeah. Why didn't they put a swear in it then? Hey! I'm top! <laughs> I, beat, I beat Simon Dennis, Greg Paul, at. Aww. Aww. <laughs> there you go, I was really interested to find that. Yeah. <laughs> Joe's go. Let's see what level of Nakatomi Tower you can get to. I got to the reception. <laughs> <laughs> I got up the flight of stairs. Oh man, I'm looking at the uh, the the manual for this. When manuals used to be like the size of, it's like a bible. Look at it, it's huge. Hey, this is my jurisdiction. <coughs> you can do it, man. See, What's LA, you? LA isn't even your jurisdiction. Hey, <laughs> you're not doing very good, man. I can't see him. This isn't like Gears of War, cover doesn't work, you just gotta... Whoa! <laughs> well that screwed me over. You got it man, you actually really have to aim at them. Like, yeah, it's like, it's, like, it's not like Doom where you can kind of just aim in the this general direction. nails! Dark. Yeah, it's fucking solid! What do you think it was gonna be? PS1 games are hard, man. I'm gonna die. Well, I'm surprised how far well, I think, you got. I think this is an arcade, these were like a collection of arcade games. Like especially oh, really? the second one, because like, so this trilogy is three games, all representing each Die Hard film. The first well, one is. Did it come out separately, or was it just Bang came out? I don't. I don't know if they came out separately. I don't know if they did. I, I'm pretty sure this. I, I'm not sure. I, I, I don't want to try and guess really, but I'm pretty sure the second one feels like it. Because this doesn't feel like a standalone game. If you paid, it's got to look at the map. They're converging on me. They are. They're, fi- they're finding you, man. If you paid forty quid for this, you'd not be happy, would you? But. Like the first one um, is a third-person shooter. The second one is a is a shoot 'em up first-person thing with a light gun, uh, and the third one is like a driving game. Um, we can't play the second one unfortunately because we don't have a a light gun. Well, I think. Uh... Do you know light guns don't work with LCD TVs? Yeah, they ha- they can only work with CRT. <laughs> was that a hostage? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a, that was another hostage show. Oh, bollocks. That's right, you just kill them left, right, and centre. I'm just. I love their faces. Their tiny, <laughs> tiny little faces. Yeah. 
there, man. Kill him. I can't remember there being this many people in the uh, in the basement in the Die Hard film. There was just that one guy that was listening to. Uh, um, uh, oh god, I can't remember his name. The artist, the blind guy who sings and he's always happy. Stevie Wonder. Stevie Wonder, yeah. <laughs> he's always happy. <laughs> he's always happy. Um, Stevie Wonder. I can't remember his name. You just remembered it. No, no, no. The guy in the car. In Die Hard 1. The chauffeur. Oh, right. Ooh. Ooh, a little. MP5, eh? Yeah, yeah. I'll take that. Can you just walk up the stairs and skip this level? No. <laughs> no. The stairs are there for Tra show. Trap stairs. <laughs> Don't, Don't go up. Away. Whoa! <laughs> Fucking spray much. Yeah. <laughs> Don't go up them stairs. Trap stairs. This trap door. I know. No. I was trying to relate, but it won't work. <laughs> <laughs> How many people have I got left to kill? Uh, eight. Uh, when you've killed so many, I think five turn up in an in, a, in an elevator. Oh, there's something it? in there. Yeah, go. What's that? Ooh. It makes no noise when you step over that. You got some more ammo. Oh, what's that? It's the. What is that? The ball pop? That was what it was called in um, Counter Strike. Pull pop. Yeah, is it the pull pop or the aug or something? I don't know. Mm. Come on, Joe, you know your guns. I don't know guns really that well. Only oh. the ones I've used. The ones you've used? Yeah. What, you... like the SA80 and the LA90? Okay, do you want to elaborate so people don't realise that you're a gun toting murderer? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was a reserve soldier. Yeah, Joe. Joe was very noble. While I sat around on my ass playing video games, Joe was out uh, training to be a reserve soldier. I was. Yeah, a few years ago. What's it like to actually fire a gun? Um, before you actually, before you actually pull the trigger and you tra you train to actually use the weapon, yeah, it's quite scary. What do you mean you use the weapon? Isn't pulling the trigger using the weapon? No, well, no, you do. You have to learn a lot of drills before you actually use the weapon, like stoppages drills. Eagerly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, and things like that. So oh, nice. Uh, but you get, and then when you pull the trigger and it's get that loud bang, and you've got you got control of the weapon. It's, it's yeah. good. It's good fun. It's a bit. It's a hell of a rush. I don't know. You do get used to it. I'd knock myself out. I think. I'm just like, it's, <laughs> it's not as it's not as powerful as you, it's not as powerful as you would let to believe. Obviously, there's different types of weapons you would. Oh, I got. I ran out of ammo. No, Back really? to my handgun. Oh yeah, you are. Yeah. Right, they're normally in the centre. I think you've been running around the edge. For yeah, yeah, I was just cleaning them up. <gasps> oh, yeah, there's a couple of hostages. Here. Right, let's go. You can do it, man. I believe in you. Be, 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 be Bruce Willis. Be the Bruce you're destined to be. Get the hell out of here! Get the hell out of here! Have you ever heard that Bruce Willis is supposed to be a bit of an asshole in real life? Really? Well, he's, he's a bit of an asshole in his films. Whoa! Whoa! You got two grenades, remember? Wow. That was that was Joe's adventure in Nakatobi Towers. He didn't make it out of the basement. Yeah. Wow, that's a hard game. That would have been a shit film. If, if, <laughs> if, if that was gone down in the basement. <laughs> ah, well, I think that's it. That's yeah, that's, that's Die Hard One. Yeah. Um, for anyone who hasn't seen Die Hard One, that's that's pretty much what happens. <laughs> it's a hell of a gunfight. Yeah, in, hostages being shot in, in the basement. In the basement. Yeah, exactly. Hostages dying. So let's see how many hostages Joe saved. It's a massacre. Yeah, man, they're on your conscience. How do you feel? Well, they're not realistic enough for me to care. 20%? It's at zero for me. I saved hostages. No, because you died on second level. You didn't oh, save anyone on that level. There you go. Joe, spell something out for us. Um, Send us off. Send us off with something. Send us off with something, eh? This is, this is, this is starting to become really original. You know that. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's... Yeah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You didn't beat tangent though. No. <laughs> tangent to But you did beat Dennis Greg Paul, Alec Ben, James and Matt. Oh right. that's changed, isn't it? No, I think Alec was there. Alec Ben James. That sounds like an actor's name. Alec Ben James. What's your name? Hey, um Alec Ben James. Alec Ben James. <laughs> See that's the 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 um the uh, I can't remember the stretch limo that you turn up in. What the, the start? Film? In the start of the film, he turns up in a limo, doesn't he? What John McClane? Yeah, does he? Yeah, he gets chauffeured by a guy. No, there's a ta he, no, there's, there's a you're on about the police officer. John McClane gets taxied in a chauffeur in a limo because he goes to see his wife at the party. They're celebrating a big thing, aren't they? That's right. And then Hans Gruber and his goons show up and and ruin the party for everyone. I haven't seen it in such a long time. 
It's fucking brilliant. I thought. Well, you got to watch it every Christmas. I thought, Christmas. He, gets, I thought he gets a taxi. Then he's on like X floor when it all kicks off, and then the guy who he speaks to in the vehicle is the police car driver, isn't it? No, there's there's there is a police driver as well, but there's also the chauffeur who's in the basement. Right, the watching. whole thing. Right, the whole thing. He's oblivious. He's in there listening to Stevie Wonder the whole time. It's good. It's a good movie from what I remember. Yeah, it was a good Christmas. It's the best Christmas movie. Don't know Gremlins. Ah, uh, it's pretty good. I wanted to show you something before we leave, Joe. Okay. Which is um, the developers of this game thought it'd be quite humorous to add more quit options. Right. So when you quit, it said a oh, quit game. No, or yes, or not really sure. <laughs> so what do you click when you click we're not really sure? It goes, choose, maybe. Ask, ask a friend. friend. Try again. Let's ask a friend. Get a life. <laughs> <laughs> what? I know. Fucking assholes. And what happens, what happens if you do maybe? So not really sure. Maybe. And then it goes back. Yeah. What assholes? So... On the note of, I think it's Probe Entertainment, the people that made this game. Probe Entertainment, are they Probe. still around? I'm guessing not. Uh, I don't know. They were. They had. They made a few um, Fox Interactive games. So they made Die Hard trilogy, Alien trilogy, and uh, I think they made Independence Day, the film, which I didn't know existed. Well, In the, the game, game they came in. Yeah. yeah, they didn't make. Yeah, they didn't make the film. <laughs> um, uh, they made the game, which I would have to hunt down actually, because that sounds like a barrel of laughs. It does. <laughs> Yeah, do a barrel roll. Is it <laughs> that a, type of game? Do a barrel of laughs. <laughs>, <laughs>, <laughs> For anyone that missed that, Joe was doing the motion of a barrel roll with his Yeah, hand. sorry, you can't that. see what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, uh, we'll do, probably do one more of this where we play uh, Die Hard with a Vengeance. Let's go. So, see you, peeps. Goodbye. Bye. What was that? Hanging up the phone. Yeah. <laughs> boop, 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 boop.